Welcome back to Tennis Talk. My name's Cam Williams. And with the Australian Open just around the corner, we saw some big names that are not playing the event this year. Some names that are actually in doubt as well for the event. Let's have a look at who's not playing. Some big names are not playing. All right, so the growing list here and some really, really big names. So we start with Guido Pella. He pulled out. Of course, Roger Federer has pulled out with that knee injury. Stan Wawrinka, he's still recovering from surgery he got last year. Raonic also pulled out. Team has pulled out. Sandgren. Nishikori and Brooksby has been the latest player to pull out. So some big names there, some Grand Slam champions and also former champions of the Australian Open. Let's go have a look at the women's side now and still massive names on this side as well, especially players that have played well in Australia in the past. Starting with Bianca Andreescu, she's pulled out. Last year's finalist, Jen Brady, she's pulled out. Last year's semi-finalist, Mukova has pulled out. The number four in the world, Pliskova, she's out. Serena Williams, biggest name on the women's side, she's out. Venus has also pulled out. And Podoroska is also pulled out on the women's side. So let's look at the players that are in doubt for the Open. And of course, the big one, Novak Djokovic. He's just been cancelled again, or his visa's been cancelled again. Waiting to see what happens with the court case in a couple of days. He is in big doubt to play the Australian Open. Also, Nick Kyrgios, not sure what his moves are after getting COVID last week. Stefano Tsitsipas, someone who is, as well is in doubt, probably going to play a few matches, but he is under a big injury cloud. Leila Fernandez also coming in with a bit of an injury after what looked like a back problem a week ago, so got to keep an eye on her. I don't know if she's going to withdraw, but definitely got to keep an eye on her. Also, Iga Fiontek saying that she had some rib problems last week, so we'll see what happens with her. And Naomi Osaka, she pulled out of a tournament last week as well. I don't think she'll be in doubt or she won't she will withdraw but still someone to watch out for because she did pull out of a tournament last week due to soreness so some players that are in doubt some that are very much in doubt some maybe not so so in doubt as others obviously the Djokovic situation is a big big red flag so there you have it big names that are not playing the event big names that might not be playing and of course the Djokovic issue is the big one he goes back to court tomorrow we'll see what happens maybe we get the answer maybe he can play We'll find out what happens in the next couple of days, but let me know down in the comments below. Who are you going to miss the most at the Australian Open? I know a lot of people will miss Federer. A lot of people are going to miss Serena. Some people might even miss Dominic Team. I'm going to miss Kyrgios if he doesn't play. I hope Nick Kyrgios plays. Um, and of course, Novak Djokovic. Is he going to play or not? We don't know. It's not really up to him, is it? So let me know down in the comments below. Who do you think is going to play? So after another big week of Djokovic news, some players are pulled out of the tournament, and of course, he's in doubt as well.